Creo Parametric 11.0 has been enhanced to improve the behavior when dealing with out-of-date foreign wrapper models open with Unite technology. For customers with the collaboration extension for the given CAD system, NX, CATIA, SOLIDWORKS, or Inventor, this will not be an issue. However, for those without the collaboration extension, Creo will now represent the out-of-date models as missing components. As in prior releases, in the absence of the collaboration extension, the Unite wrapper will not be updated if the foreign model has been modified, and Creo will retrieve the prior outdated wrapper. In this example, I'll retrieve a modified foreign model in Creo 11.0 that had previously been opened, which generated the Creo wrapper. Without the collaboration extension, Creo will retrieve the prior wrapper by default, which will not reflect the modified foreign model. While the foreign model will be retrieved successfully, Creo will notify the user that they are working with an out-of-date model via the Notification Center, Model Tree, and Message Area. The challenge is that users might miss these warnings and continue to use this model. To reduce the risk of using an outdated wrapper when the collaboration license is not available, Creo will provide a new config option to control the desired behavior. Through the Configuration Editor, I'll be able to add this new config option. The default value is yes, which means Creo will retrieve the outdated wrapper. This is the current behavior as I demonstrated prior. However, the user can also set the config option to no, which means that Creo will treat the outdated wrapper as a missing component. Alternatively, you can use the config option value as no with warnings, which means that Creo will show the warning dialog indicating a model contains out-of-date wrappers, and if accepted, will treat those models as missing components. This enhancement will improve the behavior when dealing with out-of-date foreign wrapper models opened with Unite Technology. It will reduce confusion for users that believe they are getting the latest representation of the foreign model when in fact they are retrieving a prior out-of-date representation. More importantly, it will avoid potential downstream errors when the out-of-date wrapper file is being used. The message will also advise the users to obtain the corresponding collaboration extension. If successfully obtained, the user will be able to retrieve the model and have it update successfully in the Creo session.